This upcoming Friday is National Basic Income Day of Action, a new movement across the nation. And we wanted to know more, especially because we're starting to see programs popping up all around Colorado. Joining us today is Mark Donovan. He is the founder and executive director of the Denver Basic Income Project. Mark, thank you so much for being with us. We appreciate it so much. Thanks for having me, Karen. So tell us a little bit about this idea for um, what is behind basic income, behind basic income. It's, a, it's kind of a simple idea that if you create an income floor below which people don't fall, that you'll create a safer and more stable economy and communities by avoiding sort of the downstream costs and trauma that's created by people experience, for people experiencing homelessness or just by poverty in general. This was uh, kind of your brainchild. So how did you come about with this idea and, and how did you get started with it? Well, in 2020 when COVID was hitting, I was seeing so many people um, losing their sources of income and their stability. And I felt this need to take action. And so I started to um, provide direct cash assistance to people that were experiencing the impact of COVID. And from there, saw the research that really showed the power of this. And we started organizing in 2021 and founded the Denver Basic Income Project. So, um, so now that you're, you've done this, you've started giving people a, a basic income to start from, what are you starting to see so far? Uh, we're seeing some really amazing results and they're consistent with things that we've seen elsewhere in other projects is that people will spend the money on basic needs and that it creates st some financial stability and accelerated pathways to housing, to work, to it, it acknowledges the agency of the individual to know what they need in their life. For most people, they will better allocate their resources than, than we can for them. So what's the next step for helping out these, uh, these families and these people? Well, the, uh, we're running a, a randomized control trial with DU Center for Housing and Homelessness Research. It's the uh, largest in the country that focuses on people experiencing homelessness. And we're just getting started, and so we want to keep it going and keep learning and uh, reach as many people as we can and show the power of direct cash to create, again, safer and more stable uh, communities. Do you need volunteers, do you need money, or do you need both? Well, we're having a rally at the Capitol on Friday at, new, at 11 o'clock. We're organizing and marching and having some speeches at the steps of the Capitol. We need funding to do this, and so um, we, we, we would welcome people to donate at the denverbasicincomeproject.org or just treat people that you see that are in need with respect and, and some support. Sometimes it only takes one person to believe in a person for them to believe in themselves. Fantastic. Well, thank you so much for enlightening us and opening up our eyes to this so much. And you can watch this interview and much more on our website. You can find it right now at cbscolorado.com.